Cutting hair is an art. You gotta be an artist. The, the sculpture that hair to fit the person. I've always said, if you give some, somebody what they want, they'll come back. I'm Jerry Flores. I've been here for 50 years. Come this August is my anniversary here. And uh, I've had many customers over the years that uh, have come and gone. Some of them passed away, a lot of them passed away because back then I was younger. I was about 22 when I first started here and now I'm 72. I don't know, I just thought I'd, I'd like to try it. I, I did some fooling around at home. One of my nephews when we were in high school, uh, we, <laughs> we decided to cut each other's hair. So, so that's where I kind of got into barbering a little. <laughs> Yes, I've had uh, three generations, just like uh, Laramie who's here. I, I cut his dad's hair, and I've cut his kid's hair. So I'm on the third generation. I don't know, I could be on the fourth by now. <laughs> 50 years. <laughs> you gotta have a sense of humor, and uh, you gotta uh, know how to talk to the person that's in the chair, you know, it could be, they may they need, may need a little sympathy or or you know they they think as you as a, a, a what do you say huh? a counselor or something like that says and and a lot of spiritual uh, talk too with uh, different people you know bringing them talking about the Lord because everybody's looking for the Lord nowadays and they're they're friends you know they're not really a customers because I cut their hair years and years and they've gotten to be real close friends. It's just a place for together and have conversations. <laughs>